Let, let's say your, your whole purpose is to animate it yourself, you know, if that's your <laughs> personal purpose, it, it could just be that you need money for that. <laughs> but then, you know, you, you, you need to indeed don't be attached to that and also don't get lost away on the journey. Like, that, that's, I think, the, the, the biggest problem with a lot of these celebrities, you know, and, and all of that. That's like, they, they start with a good idea, a sense of like, this is my purpose, this is why I'm here. And, I, I, you know, I need to influence people with the right uh, mindset. Like a lot of people, for example, have no idea that, that this that this uh, snitch rapper six nine, right? That, that he actually <laughs> had some videos in the beginning when he was still doing like this this rock type of music, where he was actually exposing, you know, the matrix basically, you know, the, how, the, how the world is working, you know, that they have the government, the shadow governments, and all that the cabal. They have money to for the wars, but they don't have money to feed the poor, right? The same thing with Tupac said. And that was like his whole intro of this one video. And then eventually, by the time he actually had exposed himself and became famous, what did he do? <laughs> you know, he ratted on everybody that put him in that position because the only way that he actually got all that clout, right, is because he became gang affiliated. But then he, will, he will turns on and goes against his whole gang. Well, actually, that gang is also, you know, that was actually for him a resource, you know, he, he should have used that resource in a different way instead of trying to be a gang member and gang banger himself, what he actually yeah. did, right? And therefore he did got sentenced even though he, he, he snitched on them because he did actually put on hits on other rappers and all of that on, on, on camera, right? The dummy that he <laughs> You know, but he, he should have just said, okay, cool, I need this resource gain and to, to, to pump up my career but then from there on you know I, I'm gonna make sure that I'm doing good but all he did is do worse now suddenly he's making his own videos where he has a red face in the bikini on the side <laughs> some funny shit yeah. you know like what the hell are you doing like you lose track of your whole purpose right and I think that almost all these celebrities lose their purpose or they lose track of their own purpose and if they don't do that then somehow, you know, these handlers of, of Hollywood and, uh, and the mainstream media will kick you out, right? Especially those, there's suddenly some more or less became aware and awoke of whatever was all happening, like a B.O.B., for example, right? And I believe we first started with, with even with T.I. on Grand Hustle, and now, now where he's at? You know, I have no idea. Actually, I don't know if he even still makes music. So... I think for the moment you start actually exposing what's really going on and you're fulfilling your purpose in the mainstream media, you'll be cut out, right? So you also have to understand you have to not get too deep into that, right? You, you should not get too much likes. If you start chasing likes, you know, we chase likes. That's what we always say, right? We are not chasing the likes because if you start chasing the likes and you actually do get the likes, the majority of likes, if you are popular, you must be doing something wrong because the majority of the world are NPCs. <laughs> if the NPCs don't like you, you you are definitely not fulfilling the purpose. <laughs> what do you think about that? <laughs> yeah, I mean that's exactly where I wanted to go with this, you know, our second episode for the DNT because mm -hmm. that's showing you the whole concept of becoming a shadow working light being. Right. It's not just loving, right? You know, kumbaya. This isn't for everybody. You know what I mean? So it's, it, it is hard when you want to step into this unmatrix paradigm. This ain't, this ain't just like we're posting, you know, certain things and saying this and that. Like, we're actually living this existence. Like, we have came to the experience of that. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? And there's, like, more opposition against us than actually with us and right. we want to we want to like show the people you know and tell the people especially those that you know follow follow us that hey this is what's going on right now whatever mm -hmm. you're seeing you have all this attention whatever you're seeing is actually you know pulling away your energy we're, we're like having this this platform this this uh existence of unmentions to give you back your power, you know? People 
you afraid of their own power. They'd rather look for someone else to come save them. Oh, Kanye West is going to save us. You know what I mean? Like, he, he has done nothing for me. You know what I'm saying? And people think like, oh, yeah, you know, Kanye West, he's helping the so-called black people, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, he hasn't done anything for me. <laughs> you know? Yeah.